Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. So you guys have heard of Fortnite, right? Fortnite's like the most popular game right now, and I want to see if a game like that works on something like my laptop right here, which is about two years old and is more budget oriented. Now, the only reason I'm doing this, well, one, it's, you know, just for fun. And the other one is because Fortnite isn't really a game like PUBG that requires, you know, a high end PC to play it at medium settings. Fortnite could actually run on a budget system. So, like I said, we're going to be trying it on a laptop like this one, which has a Core i5-6200U from 2016 that's a skylake processor i believe it's dual core uh and it has 8 gigs of ram i could upgrade it but i haven't done so and it has a 256 gig ssd which doesn't really matter and a full hd display now we're going to be playing it at 720p low settings and medium settings because that's what i think it could handle or maybe not even that but it, it shouldn't be able to handle epic settings you know by some miracle it'll handle epic settings but i don't think that's going to happen so low and medium settings at 720p we're going to try uh, before I get into that, um, I just want to thank you guys for breaking 15 likes on the previous video. And I want to ask if we could break 30 on this one. I know that's, you know, doubling last time's bar, I guess. Uh, but I think we could do it. You guys are pretty awesome. And we broke that overnight. So, you know, we got a couple days to break this one. Well, we got forever to break it. But, you know, I, I believe we're going to break it in a couple days. So without further delay, again, this is just for fun. Just for experiment purposes. We're going to play Fortnite on my laptop. So let's go a few moments later all right so we're in the settings right now and we're actually going to try it on medium settings first and we have a little frames per second counter right here so as you can see 1280 by 720 medium settings and medium with everything vsync is off motion blur is off and uh, we're showing fps motion blur is off because if i turn it on it's going to lower the fps and it's already pretty low so we're going to apply that and we're going to hop into a match and warning, I'm horrible at the game. I can see the frames counter right now, and even in the main menu, it's on like 26, 27 average. It turns green when it's over 30, and it turns red when it's below 20. All right, so once again, medium settings. We're hitting, we're hitting about 20 to 25. We got a 19 in there, but it looks good. It doesn't look bad. I want to see what it's like when I'm, you know, shooting someone. Oh. Wow. That had to be the worst start to a game ever. I mean, I don't even play this game, and the one time I do, that's what happens. I don't want too much action right off the bat. But we're getting frames. I saw, I saw a 6 in there. We got 6 frames per second for... I mean, frames 6 frames per second for about half uh, a second, or a quarter of a second there. Please tell me nobody landed here. But we're getting around 20 frames per second on average, I would say. Maybe around 22, 23, 19. Yeah, about 20 average. I want to get in a gunfight. Everything looks good though, but it, you can tell it's a little bit, you know, it's not completely smooth. Oh, no. Oh, wow, that guy, he's horrible. I think I saw someone else too. Someone right there. You see, that's what I don't like. You know what? Two, two could play that game. Or not. Couldn't bring it up for some reason, but... One kill, got an average of about 20 frames per second, something like that. Uh, yeah, and the game is it's pretty choppy at medium settings. So, let's move on to low settings. Alright, so we're gonna turn it down to low. Few distance near, and everything off. Once again, V-Sync and Motion Blur is off. This shot doesn't look that bad, but again, there aren't many objects. The bus does look a little bit pixelated. Alright, let's go. If I die right off the, you know, right as soon as I land, I'm not gonna play again. I'm already tired of this game. We're getting around, getting around 50 frames per second. Got a little dip of about 45 or something around there. I see someone in that house. We're gonna go after him. We're getting, getting around 60 frames per second, something like that, which is playable. I shot him twice before he shot me. Don't know what happened there. Probably my second shot wasn't completely on target. Maybe he got him like on the side or something. Because it didn't do that much damage. Definitely not as much as he did to me. But I'm going to return to lobby. That one actually seemed playable. But the picture quality wasn't that good. We got around 60, 50. I'd say an average of like 50, 55 frames per second. Uh, but the picture quality was a problem for that one. Alright, so after playing for quite a bit. 
Uh, by the way, I'm pretty bad at the game as you guys saw, but I got the scores here or the results here from both 720p medium and low settings, both at 720p. Medium looks better, you know, like with picture quality and stuff, looks better, but it doesn't run as good. I got an average FPS of 20, which, I mean, you're not going to be winning gunfights with that, and a maximum of 30. 30 would be, 30 and up would be playable, I would say, but 20 as an average, no, not really. And uh, I got a low of 5, so I believe if I kept on playing, I would have, the, the laptop would have eventually crashed. So medium settings is, you know, not playable, I would say. Uh, low settings, however, is playable, but the picture quality is just so bad. Also, so at 720p low settings, I got an average of 50 FPS, a maximum of 60, and a low of 37. So the low for the low settings, if that makes sense, was 37, and that is actually higher than all the numbers for medium settings. So you could play Fortnite on low settings here, but the picture quality, again, it's just, it's not good. Everything looks super pixelated, you can't see people from, you know, across the street and stuff. Should you be playing Fortnite on a laptop like this one? I wouldn't do so. If you do want to play Fortnite on a laptop, make sure you get one with a graphics card, or if you know if you can't really afford a laptop with a graphics card, uh, get a get the most recent ones, the ones that have like an i5 8500U. I'm not sure what they're called, but with a coffee like processor. I believe those processors are now quad core. You could run Fortnite at, at some pretty decent settings with a processor like that. It's definitely playable. So again, I mean, it seems like an obvious answer, but I wouldn't recommend Fortnite on a laptop like this one, even though, you know, as a laptop, it's perfect for productivity and stuff. I actually type all my papers and stuff, do all my schoolwork on this laptop. Uh, and I was just curious to see if it could run Fortnite, you know, maybe play it, play it at school or something, but it can't. So. so that's it for today's video. If you enjoyed, make sure to leave a thumbs up. Uh, again, we're trying to break 30 likes, which for sure, you know, I'm 100% I'm sure we could do it. Thank you guys for watching. Maybe consider subscribing. Uh, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Have a great day.